Good morning. It's Thursday, May the 8th, and you're watching Chinese Small Cap TV here every day exclusively on ChinaSecurities.com. I'm your host, Paul Kandakos. Chinese Small Cap TV is a daily, fast-paced, edgy show, bringing the best press releases out of the Chinese small cap sector in the AM so that you can ultimately profit from them and potentially find your next great small cap investment. I've got two great press releases for you this morning. So without any further ado, let's get down to business. Our lead story comes out of a company called Harbin Electric Inc. They trade on the NASDAQ, the big board, under the symbol HRBN. The company is announcing their first quarter results for 2009. The company is a developer and manufacturer of a wide array of electric motors. So now let's get down to the numbers. Companies announced that revenues increased 37% to $31 million. Net income for the quarter totaled $8.6 million compared to 5.3 for the same quarter last year. It's a 62% increase in net income. Earnings per share increased 44% to $0.39 cents per share. Uh, now, I've got a little bit about the company. They're a leading developer and manufacturer of a wide array of electric motors with a focus on innovative, customized, and value-added products. Companies last at $9.86, high of $19.25, low of $4.25, and the market cap of approximately $217 million. Moving over to our next company, Memzik. They trade on the NASDAQ as well under the symbol GM. The company is also announcing their first quarter 2009 financial results. Uh, we've got revenue for the first quarter was $6.6 .6 million. It represents a 5% increase from the first quarter of 2008. Net income for the first quarter was $57,000 on a gap basis. Uh, but that's compared the net income of $1.5 million in the first quarter of 2008. So it looks like they're down significantly on net income. You might want to take a look at the press release and the company, see why they're down so substantially. Uh, the company's non-GAAP net income for the first quarter was, uh, for 2008 was $1.8 million, uh, which excluded stock-based compensation of $300,000. A little bit about the company, they provide advanced semiconductor sensor and system solutions based on integrated micro-electromechanical systems. They're last at $2.70, 52-week high of $7.38, low of $1.28, and a mark cap of approximately $64 million. That's a wrap for me. I'm your host, Paul Kandakos. It's Friday, so have yourselves a great weekend. I will catch you here on Monday when we've got more great press release coming out of the Chinese small cap sector in the AM.